Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jennifer, and if you are new here, thank you so much for clicking on this video. Um, and if you're not new here, thank you so much for clicking on this video too. Today's video, if you are easily grossed out, I'm gonna tell you just to, just to get out of here now, click off of it. It is very, very different from my normal videos, but if you're not easily grossed out, if you are into any type of skincare, blackhead removal, like those weird type of, I don't know, pimple videos, then this is it. This is, this is where it's at. Um, I ordered one of those vacuum blackhead remover. I was very skeptical. I didn't actually think that it was gonna do anything, but I was pleasantly surprised. And you can view it on your phone here while you're doing it, which is actually super, super cool. I saw a couple people on YouTube review them. I looked at a few different kinds on Amazon, finally decided on one, ordered it, used it on myself and my fiance, and it was satisfying to say the least. So I did take some videos of it. We did it very late at night, which is why I didn't like do it and record and film all at the same time because it was very late at night. But I did take some videos. Um, I did not watch the video of my fiance's yet, so I will be watching that for the first time with you guys. So yeah, without further ado, let's just let's just hop in and get grossed out together. Cause why not? I mean, what better do I have to do with my time? Nothing. So let's get into it. I'll do my fiance's first, cause I don't think mine was that bad. I don't really have horrible blackheads, so maybe we'll do my fiance's first. So weird. No way. Hell, you can see it on the thing. That's so gross. This one was actually really nice because if you stayed on one spot of your skin too long, it would flash a warning and tell you um, don't stay more than two seconds. Like it would say something like don't stay more than two seconds. So it would let you know if you've been on a section of your skin for longer than that two second period because um, it is a, a, not like a super strong suction, but it is a suction on your skin. Um, and it can like, you know, bruise your face if you're leaving it on for too long. So I thought that this one having that warning was really nice um, because it can kind of get addicting and you want to like keep it on there longer to like suck out as much as you possibly can. So it was nice to have that on there to remind you to like move it around. So um, I will link the, the one that I ordered down below. Okay, so I'm pretty sure this is mine now. Yeah, this one is mine. I'm saying I don't think mine was that bad, but I could be totally wrong. If you've never, oh. If you've never looked at your skin under a microscope, I encourage you to do so. Oh. Oh my God, do you guys see all that? Oh. Like just ordering this to look at my skin under a microscope was like probably the coolest thing I'd ever done. Like you think your skin is clean, but it's actually not, it's disgusting. <laughs> Oh my gosh. 
I will say there's like a lot of blackheads though that it's, oh, that was a lot that I got right there. But there's also quite a few that it's not getting. I did use it on the lowest setting though. So there's three settings. I did use it on the lowest one because I was scared of like bruising and um, it being too hard on, on our skin. So I didn't want to go any higher than that. Oh, this is so weird. Oh. As I'm watching this back though, I think I will use it on a higher setting next time though, because there's like a lot in there that it's not getting. And I wasn't realizing it at the time. My face is going to be permanently stuck like that, like this, just from watching this video. grossest thing is just like the blackheads all around the rim like that's just sick like I can't get like I just want to like go and do it again now it's like addicting so a couple of things I will say um to make sure that your skin is cleansed before you do this like super clean wash it um make sure you're Get all your makeup off, all dirt, all debris, um, and make sure it's very, very clean because you don't want to um, get that gunk and dirt any deeper into your skin when you're doing this. And then also, whatever area of your face that you are going to um, suction out, like blackheads or anything else, make sure that you steam it. So either like make a bowl of very, very hot water and dip your head over it, let the steam hit it, or just take a washcloth and put it in um, very warm water, like as warm as you can tolerate and hold that warm compress over like your nose, your T-zone, your chin, whatever area you're planning on um, suctioning with the machine. Um, but yeah, I really enjoyed it. I thought it was super fun. I know that probably sounds crazy, but I really enjoyed it. It was so satisfying, um, especially doing it on my fiance. So do it on someone else. Like if you have a partner or if you live with your parents, maybe try to convince your parents to let them do it. Or if you have a roommate um, or anyone else, um, try convincing them to let you do it on them because it's very, very fun. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys because it really um, was kind of, you know, not only satisfying, but it does make your pores look um, cleaner and also smaller because if your pores are cleaned out and they don't have dirt and debris in them, they obviously are going to look smaller and who doesn't want smaller pores? So I just wanted to make this quick little video, share it with you guys, and I will also link it down below that way in case you guys want to check it out. Order one for yourselves, you can. It really was very inexpensive. I think it was 
maybe around 30 bucks or so. Um, but yeah, that is it for me, guys. Until the next one. Um, I'm sorry, that is my phone. Let me shut that off. Um, until the next one, I love you guys, and you are amazing and beautiful inside and out. Bye.